Hi guys, you might have seen the video where I made this lenticular solar rocker. Uh, somebody had requested it. Now they've tried to do the same thing with their lenticular picture and it doesn't give enough movement for them. So, there's a few things we can do. We can play around with the balance. That's why I've got little bits of um, blue tack on the end there. And you can play around with the actual pivot point to change the amount of movement. Uh, small movement at the bottom will give a big movement at the top, if you can get it balanced back on the rocker. Um, so there's a few things you can do with it like it is and adjusting the exact position of the um, the coil makes a difference as well as to how far it will rock. But I've been looking at something totally different. Uh, oh, sunshine. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I've had this for quite a while. A 4-in-1 solar dinosaur. There's quite a few different variations, but they're all based on the same thing. You have a little solar panel, electric motor, and a big gearbox to give it plenty of power. So it's a bit noisy, but if I link that axle there to the bottom of this, then we can actually make it rock backwards and forwards using that. So that's what I'm going to do. So, Little circle bent on there, just so that will sit on there. That'll give us our forwards backwards motion. A bit of plastic tubing cut from a cotton bud, one of those horrible ones with the plastic tubes. But I actually use the plastic tubes. And then we need to stick this on here. I mean, I suppose I could stick it on the back. Just for demonstration purposes, I'm just using some blue tack. use a bit of tape I think that blue tack's not going to hold it it's actually white white tack and it's just not sticky enough I haven't noticed it before I always thought blue tack and white tack were equal but I found recently it might be because it's old that my white tack is losing its stickiness that again.
I have to adjust these a bit because it can have too much power, I think. Along there, right, that needs to be a bit lower down, I think. I think a longer paper clip would have been a good idea, too. Let's move that down a bit. probably tell from the table I was actually doing something else. <laughs> I was doing a jigsaw. So there we go, still solar powered, but we've got an electric motor with a gearbox giving us a rocking motion. Just adjust the pivot points to get the motion you want. Noisy, though. Thanks for watching. You'll find more information down in the video description. You might like to watch that video up there, and you might like to subscribe over there. <laughs>